hi guys welcome back to a youtube channel so in this tutorial we're gonna learn how can we extract the data in autocad so this is the file that we want to extract the data so to extract it you just have to click on insert and here we have the group of linking and extraction just click on this option or you can use the shortcut key data extraction that is dx press enter and this box appear where you have to select whether you want to create a new data extraction or you want to edit the existing one so i'll select this create a new data extraction then click on next now you have to select that location where you want to save the extracted file so i'll choose this document and rename it as data ext then click on save now this page 2 of page 8 comes where you have to select the data source so I'll click on this, this select the object and then you have to click on this one and then select the object with whom you want to extract the data I'll select this one then press enter and then you have to click on this next and now guys this page 3 of page 8 comes where you will be where you will be shown all the objects of whatever you have selected here so here we have the m text arc the polylines okay so the what is the display name and if they are block or not so if you want to filter the blocks and non blocks so you can filter it from here but in this project we don't have any block we just only have non blocks so it is currently disappeared and if you want to display the attributes only so you can check it or you can uncheck it and then click on next and just after clicking on next you guys you can see your data extraction all the properties are shown here so what you want to show like I don't want to show the start angle, the rotation. I don't want to show this 3D visualization. Okay. And then click on next. So you have to select here what the data you want to extract from your project. And then click on next. Just after clicking guys, your data is now extracted. As you can see here. This is the file that you have extracted here. And if you see some of the columns are very empty, these are totally empty like this subject. So you can delete it, just select this subject, okay, do right click on that and hide columns. Similarly, you can do this for all the columns that you don't want to show there, like this keyword hyperlink and hyperlink paste. You want to hide all these columns. So you're going to hide this again here is the comment let's hide this too let's hide this author let's hide this show borders also click on next and now this is the final step that you have to take that you want to insert data extraction table into the drawing or you want to extract the data as excel file so i'll select both of these and then click on next just click on next and then finish now if you see in your cursor your data is now active the extracted data you have in your cursor you can click on the screen and now your extracted data is now here applied you can zoom over there and you can see all the details okay you can scale it to increase the size guys select it and use sca press enter select the reference point and how many times you want to increase i'll select two then enter so guys this way you can extract the data in autocad hope you like this video thank you if you really like the content then please like the video and click subscribe to see more videos like this and don't forget to share this video with others you can find the link to complete basics to advanced excel tutorial in the description below or you can visit mahagurus.com to see lots of other software courses thank you